Madam Speaker, this summer, the government abruptly and without consultation added significant new study permit requirements for those wishing to compete, complete language courses in Canada before entering a degree program. This added red tape is dulling Canada's competitive edge in attracting international students, and decreased fall enrollment in language institutes already is reflecting this. Can the Minister tell the numerous educational groups and institutes that have urgently co contacted many of us across party lines, I'm sure my colleagues in the government have even had these calls, uh, when he is going to uh, talk to them about their concerns, when he's going to address their concerns more importantly. The Honourable Minister of <coughs> Citizenship. Well, I can say, Madam Speaker, that we are addressing this issue of these conservative imposed rules, which are causing some trouble, and I'm hoping to have a response in September. But I can also say on the international students, we want to court international students. We have reversed their provision to take away the 50 per cent credit for citizenship, and we are adding points for international students on express entry. So, Madam Speaker, we Liberals are working for international students and reversing what these people did. Here, here, here.